Welcome back. Once an afterthought, it's now a cultural phenomenon. Women's professional sports in America are booming. The women's NCAA basketball tournament had more viewers than the men's this year. Ticket prices and TV ratings are soaring in the WNBA finals right now. And women brought home the lion's share of Team USA's medals in the Paris Olympics. In an exclusive Meet the Moment interview for this Sunday's Meet the Press, I sat down with a part pair of female sports icons who helped pave the way. Olympic gold medalist and two-time FIFA World Cup champion Megan Rapinoe and five-time Olympic champion and four-time WNBA champion Sue Bird for their perspective on the state of women's sports. Here's some of that conversation. Now you're seeing the investment match the quality and the ability of the players. You're seeing the investment match the appetite that the fans have and the demand from the fans. The demand from the fans has been there the whole time. There's just things haven't been available, whether that's on streaming or whether that's on TV or um, whatever it may be. And I think this moment is like, I feel like we just came to the end of all the excuses of why nobody likes women's sports. And it turns out everybody watches women's sports. Everybody likes it. Everybody's into it. Turns out, oh, we're really good at sports. We're really entertaining. We're actually really amazing off the court. We, we care about our teammates. We care about our community. We care about um, politics. We care about making the world a better place. And it's an incredibly desirable product for people to watch, for players to play in, for sponsors to sponsor, for people to put on TV. So it's like we always just feel like we've, we've been knowing this is ready, and I feel like everyone else is now ready for that. A lot of times we're not looked at based on our potential, right? Whether it's a young athlete, somebody who has already accomplished a lot, it's never like, oh, let me invest in this and see what happens in five to 10 years, because I see something. It's always, okay, what have you done? And do, I, do, I des do you deserve to be paid now based on what you did do? But never looking to the future. I would challenge, you know, corporate sponsorships, so companies, businesses, um, TV networks, to start looking at us based on our potential, what they think is gonna happen, not, well, let's wait and see in a couple years to see if this is real. Like, none of that. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.